as though you had nothing on underneath. I haven't. How very imprudent. And how highly improper. But there are no men here, so how could it be improper? Have you noticed how difficult it is to be improper without men? God, Lady Caroline, we have been assured as a man. Oh! Well, good morning. Lady Caroline! You've arrived. Which is great, yes! Late last night, but... Without clothing, apparently. Oh, ladies, excuse me. Yes, excuse us, Mrs. Graves, Lady Caroline. We hadn't thought you'd arrived. Here we are. Yes, not that we're not happy to see you. It's just a great disappointment. No, what Lord <laughs> means is that we had so hoped to welcome you. We were going to choose the nicest rooms for you. And we've done that. Well, we were going to make them all pretty with flowers. Costanza has seen to everything in her way. Mrs. Grace and I arrived yesterday morning. Together. Look at this place, Rose. When I awoke this morning, I prepared myself to accept whatever I might find, but I couldn't have imagined the flowers. Snap dragons and periwinkles and Daphne's and iris and lavender and cherry trees and, and wisteria, Mrs. Grace, simply tumbling over itself. Yes. And sunshine. Heaven. Ah, buona mattina, signore. Scusatemi. Si, signora. It is time for breakfast. Adesso? Breakfast! Si, si, breakfast. Colazione. Oh, imperialista. I saw to it that breakfast was delayed one hour for your first day. It will not be done again. Come, ladies. We must be prompt or Costanza will take it as a sign that she too may be last. We've been displaced as hostesses. None of us is hostess here. We're all equal. Smells of fragrance, Rose. It's positively sensual. It makes me want to kiss someone. <laughs> Do you know who would love all of this? Who? Never mind. Paradiso. Our first day in heaven. And Gabriel, he had to greet us. Paradiso! <laughs> <laughs>